Learning the names of each individual part of your Glock pistol will not only improve the enjoyment of your firearm, but using the same terms as the factory designers and Glock armors eliminates any confusion during discussion about your Glock. These are the names of each part of the Glock in order of their removal. Floor plate, magazine insert, magazine spring, follower, magazine tube. Recoil spring assembly. The parts of the barrel are the chamber, the feed ramp, the hood, the barrel lug, and the muzzle crown. Slide cover plate. Here are the parts of the firing pin assembly. Spring cups, firing pin spring, spacer sleeve, firing pin. The extractor depressor plunger assembly. This includes the spring loaded bearing, the extractor depressor spring, and the extractor depressor. The extractor. Firing pin safety, firing pin safety spring. The front and rear sights along with the firing pin channel liner will stay in place on the slide. Locking block pin, trigger pin, slide stop lever, the locking block, trigger mechanism housing pin, trigger assembly, trigger with the trigger bar, trigger spring, connector, and that leaves us with the trigger mechanism housing. Although I don't use it, Glock has the option of the New York trigger, which converts the 5 pound trigger into an 8 pound. They also have the New York 2 trigger, which converts the 5 pound to a 12 pound trigger. We continue with the slide lock, slide lock spring, our magazine catch. the magazine catch spring and that leaves us with our bear receiver